Hello and welcome to The Daily Lowdown, your fix of everything in the world of celebrity, music and entertainment news. Megan Thee Stallion has been granted a restraining order against her record label 1501 Certified Entertainment. The rapper alleges that the record company had been interfering with her control over her music ahead of the American Music Awards, which take place later this week. The savage hitmaker doesn't reveal specifically what had occurred, but claims in the legal documents that 1501 had taken unlawful steps to block Megan from publishing her own music in the lead-up to the event, for which she is nominated in the Favourite Female Hip-Hop Artist category. The star also claims that because voting has recently closed, her career will suffer as a result of not using her tracks in conjunction with the promotion. A hearing for the ongoing case will take place on the 22nd of November. Rihanna has revealed her hopes to get Beyonce on board for her Savage by Fenty fashion show. Chatting to reporters at her recent event, the umbrella hitmaker explained that Beyonce would be her number one dream runway model, adding that getting Queen Bee for the next show would trump everything else for her. Meanwhile, you can catch Riri's latest Savage fashion show, which features Gigi Hadid, Cara Delevingne, Joan Smalls and more, now on Prime Video. Speaking of the AMAs, it's been revealed that Pink will be paying a tribute to the late Olivia Newton-John at the awards with a special performance. The singer will take to the stage to honour the Greece actress who passed away in August at the age of 73, although the details of her tribute are not yet known. Pink is set to perform a second time during the awards to preview her new track, Never Gonna Not Dance Again. Meanwhile, other performers for the event include Stevie Wonder, Bibi Rexa and David Guetta. The awards will take place at the Microsoft Theatre in LA on Sunday the 20th of November. Stormzy has spoken candidly about his split from Maya Jama and how it affected him. Speaking in a new interview with GQ, the bossy bop rapper admitted that when he and Maya called time on their relationship in 2019, it made him realise he needed to grow up. Stormzy also explained that the breakup still weighed heavy on his heart afterwards, as he realised that he needed to work on himself to grow from a boy into a man, and that he never wants to be in that position again. Hand on my heart, this is my biggest of regrets. Thought I say it here, then rather fling it in a text until you're ready to forgive. I'm always wishing you the best. And Len Goodman revealed a shock announcement during Monday's episode of Dancing with the Stars, telling the audience that after 17 years, he will be stepping down from his role as a judge on the US Latin and Ballroom competition. It has been a huge pleasure to be a part of such a wonderful show. Len, who was also known for his long-running stint as head judge on our very own Strictly Come Dancing, told host Tyra Banks during the recent semi-finals that it had been a huge pleasure to be a part of the show since it began in 2005, but that he's taken the decision to leave so that he can spend more time with his family and grandchildren back home in the UK. And that's your daily lowdown from Hello. Check out our social media channels and hellomagazine.com for more news and updates on your favourite celebrities. 